I forgot how difficult it is to train a dog, you know? I don't know how these homeless people do it. <laughs> that is not a knock against the homeless at all. They lead very difficult lives filled with hardship and we need to be looking out for them more. I'm saying if there's one group of people that knows how to train a dog, holy shit, the homeless have figured it out. It's fucking crazy. <laughs> You ever seen a homeless person with a dog? That is the most obedient dog you will ever see. They are so good. Your friends will send their dogs away to like doggy day camp or whatever will come back. They will not be as good. I'm telling you right now. The homeless have figured it out. You've seen a homeless person with a dog, right? That dog never runs up, never jumps on anybody else, doesn't run out into traffic, never does anything shitty. It just follows that person everywhere. It's incredible. Which there has to be some questions, at least, on the part of the dog, right? Right? Like, are we ever going home? <laughs> no? All right, cool. I guess we just run these streets. Tight. This isn't a one-time thing I've seen either. It's not like I saw this once. Every single time I see a homeless person with a dog, it is the most obedient dog I have ever seen. Homeless people are so good at training dogs that they don't even own leashes. That's fucking wild to me. <laughs> They don't even use a leash, it's crazy. If I took my dog off the leash, it would immediately run into oncoming traffic. <laughs> or bolt into the woods with the kind of determination that would make it seem as though I had been preventing him from a quest. <laughs> He'd be like, I'm off to find the ring. I'm like, good luck, my man, Godspeed. Would never see him again. Here's the thing that bothers me about this, okay? I love dogs so much, I do, but I see rescue shelters everywhere, which is great, but you know what I don't see anywhere anymore? is fucking homeless shelters. I never see them anywhere, which leads me to this idea. We should start building homeless shelters on top of rescue shelters, hiring the homeless people to train the dogs, then we're housing and employing the homeless. The dogs are more obedient, so that increases their chances of getting rescued. Everyone's off the street. That's a fucking win-win for everybody. Then when you go to pick up the dog, they're like, yeah, you could also take home Greg. <laughs> he loves animals, he loves the outdoors. <laughs> White women would be all over that. Like, oh my God, he's perfect, I have to have him. Your Instagram feed would just be pictures of them with matching hats and the cider mill. <laughs> With captions like, I thought I was rescuing him. But it turns out he was rescuing me. 